Friday night on ACTV. Now let me tell you what it means to me. When the moon hits the sky like banana cream pie good with carmen. Eat bananas each day cause they're healthy and gay and so charming. I'm the queen of the cooking scene and I fill your screen with delicious creations. You'll see tippy tippy tea while my famous spread throughout the nation. A sensation when your love's gone away and you're feeling oi bay eat bananas. Cook with carbon each day and you'll get up and go all the way. Scream for bananas and cream, it's alarming. Sue's a me, but you see, back in Austin, that's cooking with karma. Hi, and welcome to a special edition of the Carmen Banana Show, Carmen's Banana Cooking, when Carmen does drag. Aye! Now listen, I know what all of y'all are thinking. You're thinking that, well, drag, that's getting in dresses and acting campy and having a lot of fun, but there is another definition for the word drag, and that definition is the Renaissance Marketplace at 23rd and Guadalupe. And here we have these wonderful arts and crafts men and women that are out here displaying their work. And we'll explain throughout the day. So it involves a licensing procedure, but let's not worry about how to get the license and how to sell in here. Let's just come on in and come on and do some drag with Carmen. Let's see who all's here. Well, hello. How are you doing? Huh? Fine. Now, your how name you is? Hans Flintke. And Hans, how long have you been selling here on the drag? Ah, uh, about 12 years. That long. Yeah. Well, you have some real interesting, this is all leather work? All leather, you know, I have some jewelry items out of nails and other materials here, but mostly leather. This is really interesting. Yeah. Well, you know, what we're you know, Christmas is just around the corner, and we were looking for some Christmas gifts. Do you have any suggestions for Christmas gifts this season? Well, there's, uh, besides here, this is a wonderful market. But go and see the Armadillo Christmas Bazaar, you know, it's the place to go to, in the Opera House. It really is. The, yeah. the uh, 14 days before Christmas, that's where all the fun yeah. is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. But why don't you describe some of the items? I see you have some purses here. Uh -huh. All the pictures you see here are hand-carved. What I try to do is keep a dying art alive, you know. The, most uh, leather carvers are a little older than me. And it's, uh, it, apparently it takes too much time to to make it happen, but I still like the carving and I enjoy doing it. And what you see here, some fancy little bags here, is a fusion of glass work. A friend of mine, he makes these beautiful glass stones, all different colors, you know, I set them in leather, some beadwork around, and have elk leather and uh, deer skin. Uh, even got some woodwork here, you see these little bitty buttons? Oh yeah. Out of wood, you know, I'm making myself out and of I cedar. I some bone buttons over there. Bone, yeah, I made those too. Right, and some knife holders. Well, Hans, listen, it was sure nice talking to you. Yeah. Looks like there's plenty of Christmas gifts here, isn't there? Yeah, and we are working on it. Yeah, really. Yeah. Still, still staying busy. Yeah. Thanks, right. we'll see you. All right. I'm Jean. Jean, how are you? Fine. And how many years have you been selling down on the drag? Oh, about... Well, uh, this is my first year. Your first year, I right. see. How did you hear about this marketplace? Oh, by wandering around down here. And would you describe your craft? It looks like you're doing some kind of leaded glass. Uh, I'm doing stained glasses, sun catchers. Oh, so you put them in your window like this? Uh huh. Or I see. Here's a, an on. Some, I'm sorry, what? Also got earrings too. They're beautiful. Yeah. Oh, I see out of glass. Yes. 
Certainly some Christmas ideas here, isn't there? I'm Dean Cardwell, and this is what I do for a living. Uh, it's a Japanese art form that was started by fishermen about 900 years ago, and they're impressions that I make directly from the actual fish. And I take a tiny brush and paint the inks directly onto the fish, and I mean, I can ink every scale a different color. Oh. And then I twist it to give it its movement and put a Japanese rice paper over the top and do a pressing. So they're impressions directly from the specimen. Same thing with the corals and plants. Then I hand paint the eye in. I see. So each one is like an individual original yes. print they're then. All one of a kind. No two the same. This is a flounder from Padre Island, and this is a little sunfish from Barton Creek here in town. Oh. I don't have any bananas. I've never been able to get an impression off a banana oh, because no. they don't have scales. Oh no. <laughs> but if in your wanderings you ever find a scaled banana, <laughs> okay, you know, keep, I'll keep an keep eye it, out for keep it. Keep it really. for me. <laughs> keep it for me because uh, I might be able to use it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, Dean, thanks a lot for showing. What, isn't there a name for this art? Yeah. It's called Gyotaku. Gyotaku. Gyo, Gyo G Y O's real low in the throat. Uh -huh. Gyo. Taku. Gyo. Gyo Taku. Okay, great. Well, thanks, Dean. Good now, to see you. You're going to also be at the Armadillo Christmas Bazaar, Every aren't year you? For a long time, I've been doing the Armadillo Christmas Bazaar. Really? Just, I know, I'll uh, be there for sure. A regular. A regular. A regular. Okay, a lot of Christmas ideas here, folks. Lots of ideas. Should we just keep m mosing? Thanks, Dean. Uh, well, it's middle school. The jewelry is sterling silver, surgical stainless steel ear wires. Sculpture is brass and copper. It's mounted on marble. Uh -huh. So I, what do I see? I see some oil wells, some Wind windmill. Wheels. Oh, the windmill's turning. Look at sure. that. Blow on it. I'm, are you kidding? <laughs> I'd be arrested. <laughs> There's certain things you can't do when you dress you, like you this. You turn the pedals on my bicycle even. Okay. See? You can play with the helicopter also. The blades uh -huh. turn on it. So well, we, we try and make it functional. Well, it sounds like you're having a lot of fun. I enjoy what I do. A little too much fun. <laughs> hey, listen, I enjoy what I do too. Hey, I bet you do. <laughs> and now, let's check into the kitchen and see what Professor Banana has for us. You, I know, are very interested in how physics works, and I can show you that. You know, every day, every day you get up, there is more physics. <clears throat> what I have is to show you conservation of energy with the banana. So, what I do is I hold this on my nose, and I'm going to let it go, and I want you to see what happens to it. You see, it goes out and it comes back. There it is. It is physics. It is conservation of energy. Thank you. My name's uh, Barbara Sutherland. Barbara, what kind of work are you doing? This is uh, stoneware pottery, and it's fired to 2,383 degrees, and it can be put in your oven or your microwave, and it's dishwasher safe. Oh. So you can use it. Well, maybe I should get some of this. Uh, my, I need some new cooking utensils for uh, Casa Carmen. Mm -hmm, maybe you should. Anyone that sees my TV show knows I have the worst utensils in the world. I've noticed that. <laughs> and usually not enough of them either. Of course. No one ever does when they're cooking. Really? Listen, we're going to keep mosey and try to look for some more Christmas gifts. Well, great. Thanks, thanks for, for stopping. Uh, and thanks for talking to us. We'll see you. Well, hi, folks. How are y'all doing? <laughs> Did you ever think you'd be on the Carmen Banana Show? Unfortunately, yes. Oh, no. You knew that sooner or later it'd be your turn, wouldn't it? How long do you and I go back? Twelve years. And it's been a good twelve years, I tell you. What are you? Yeah, I was eight and Shannon was only three. Yeah. A child. <laughs> oh. Fatima, how are you doing? Real good. How about yourself? Oh, I think I'm losing it, but that's all right. Oh, I've, I, <laughs> you found it. I lost it. Honey, I have always loved your work. Oh, this is so much fun. What are you? How, would you describe this while I'm looking at some of these things? This is a wheel thrown piece. It's a candlelight. It's made out of 300 grams of clay. It's available in seven pastel shades. I punch them out myself, and they're leather hard. And then I, and then I use the little cutouts in my uh, fish. This is my, one of my latest creations. Oh, I see. Well, doesn't the water? come through this when you drink out of it? <gasps> oh no, Carmen. <laughs> Nothing like that. What are, this is for a candle. Oh, it's a candle yeah, holder. A oh, candle I light. see. So that the shadow then goes up on the wall. And now these are baskets. They're for uh, the bathroom, bedroom, kitchen, baby's room. Uh -huh. and then I have these uh, 
tea bag rest, soap dish, kitchen caddy. To wash it, you turn it upside down in the dishwasher, or if you don't have a dishwasher, in the dish drainer, upside the down. Okay. Okay, great. Oh, and I see you have something with Texas on it down there. I'm carrying uh, Texas ashtrays with the little cutouts for the ashtrays and the non-Texas ashtrays for our non-smoking friends. <laughs> Well, you're the first person that made ashtrays for non-smokers. Yes, that's true. <laughs> that's it, folks. You remember, you saw it first here on the Karma Banana Show. Ashtray for non-smokers. Right. Well, listen, Fatima, thanks for stopping. No, wait, I, I stopped by, didn't yes. I? Yes. <laughs> yes, thanks for stopping. I have so much trouble remembering things. You too? If I'm coming or if I'm going. All right. Oh, look at these tie-dyed t-shirts behind you. Let's just run right over here and see what they are. Isn't it fun coming over here on the drag? Oh, what a sweet doggy. Hi. Well, we can start singing like the Cup of Well, honey, you have to come over here oh, so right. we can interview you. I'm sorry. Uh, now th these are, these are um, all... I'll sing Copa Cabana. <laughs> no, come thanks. On. I... Copa. I... Come on. You, you I, I don't remember the let, words. Let your fantasies come I, through. I just well, can't I'm remember it. Okay. Copa, At the Copa, Copa Cabana. Cabana. Okay, that's okay, it. That's it. Okay, um, next act. These are, these are all tie-dye. We have tights. These cotton lycra tights. Mm, oh, look, green. I love tights. Yeah, we need to give car in it. We do uh, all these different colors. We work with two colors. We've been doing it for three years. Uh, let me ask you. I know this. I hope this doesn't sound tacky, sure. but does this does this wash out? No. Oh no. These are all permanent they're, colors. They're permanent. Yes. I see. So you can just have one of these forever. Right. Like this one's been washed like four or five times. As you Has can see it? This one. Oh yes. These are all permanent, all cotton, and uh -huh. really nice. And you can spill. I'm always spilling coffee over everything I oh, open my shirt. Right out. Yeah. Surely. Oh, that's Surely. Well, you don't even need to wash. Right. It. See, so if you get a coffee stain on this, you know it'll, it'll be it would really hard. Nice. Right. Right. Really. I drink too much coffee, but. You know. Well, anyways, I didn't mean to tell you the I've story. I've never met you, Carmen. Uh, it's nice to see you out on the drag in drag, you know. And uh, well, that's the name of our show. Oh. Carmen does drag. Okay, well, it's great. great well, listen, for it. we're going to keep moseying around. Bye. What is your name now? My name's Terry. Terry. Okay, Terry. Good to meet you. We'll talk to you later. Hiya, Carmen Banana. How are you doing? Great. Today? Great. Nice to see you. Now, Good your name you. is Walter Falk. Walter Falk. Walter, you have been on the drag for how many years? 17 years in the Renaissance market selling watercolors. We've seen you a lot of times right. down here, haven't we? Well, you certainly well, let have. Let me get out of the way. Let me sign no. over on this side, and why don't you describe your watercolors to us? Well, I work in a little over 600 different series. This is one that's a recent one on cantinas with tropical paintings. Oh, And this I one love. says, uh, let us drink where the lights never come down, the Christmas lights. Then we have the carousels as allegories on spring. Uh -huh. And instead of a machine, it's driven by the wind with bird song for the music. Oh. And we have your basic castles, mm -hmm. philosophical now, paintings. Is this wa it's watercolor, it's watercolor and then what? Well, some of these, like this is a Japanese ink that I've ground down on a stone uh -huh. and painted with brush. The gold around this is an enamel. Uh -huh. So some of them are multiple media, oh, really. I see. Uh -huh. I see. Well, they're but they're really all done by hand, and I sold over 10,000 watercolors in the Renaissance market. Boy. You know, like at Armadillo Christmas Bazaar and the so Texas also. Renaissance Festival and the Pecan Street Festival. I tell you, you go out all the fun places. Yeah, don't you? all the fun places. Really, really. Well, listen. Every day, anytime you come down here on the drag, you're sure to see Falk because he's well, all. Sure nice of you to visit us down here. It's wonderful to see you. You're looking good today. Oh, well, thank you. We I'll put you in one of these cantina paintings. Really? We're just going to have to have our Carmen Banana and San Miguel really? Allende series. Really? I love that. Where the drink, where the lights, where the Christmas well, the lights. Christmas lights never come down. Really? This one over here, Carmen, you'll notice Carmen, <clears throat> the tropical birds have flown in from nature because nature is not nearly as much fun as some good nightlife. <laughs> and they've taken up around the plants. Uh -huh. And these little birds are having a fight on the devil masks. So it suggests uh -huh. that... Uh, if music charms a savage beast, a good nightlife can certainly enrage it. <laughs> Words of wisdom, folks. Falk, thanks a lot. Not not nice seeing you. Oh yes, it's going to be great. Hi, do we have some tourists over here? It's Tourist City. Where, where are you guys from? Uh, we're from Austin. You're from Austin? Natives. And are you really native? No, I'm lying. Listen, <laughs> are you one of those fake guests that go on guest shows and don't tell the truth? No, no. Okay, I want the truth. Now, where are you, you from? It. From Houston, Texas. Houston! Yes. And what are you doing here in Austin? I uh, go to school. But you can try to be serious. We're trying to have a serious TV show, and you can't even keep your face straight. Maybe if you get that yellow off your lips. Uh, okay. Not everyone's perfect. <laughs>
<laughs> okay, I'm sorry, you go to school here? I go to school. Uh, at UT? For the last seven years. Seven years. <laughs> <laughs> Shouldn't you be graduating pretty soon? I should have graduated four years ago. Are you one of those uh, what professional students? Perpetual. No, just Perpetual. stupid. Just <laughs> <laughs> an honest man, folks, an honest man. And are you from Houston also? Nope. Where are you from? Arizona. At what part? Phoenix. Phoenix, that's a nice place. But you're living here now, and you? I'm from Kilgore. Kilgore, the Kilgore Ranger Yeah. Come on, give me some high steps. Oh, that was great. <laughs> Woo, boy, I tell you. Well, listen, thanks a lot. And do you come down to the drag very often? Every day. Every day. Mm -hmm. Do you buy much, I mean, besides your uh, beer? <laughs> um, so we can't advertise Pepsi yeah, on Yeah, I've bought show. a little bit. I've, I've even bought one of these uh these fine from box yes everyone's hat yay everyone's box yay yeah, yeah. Right. and so is this would you recommend all of our fans yeah. out there in tv land to, to buy all their christmas gifts here yes renaissance market your yay. christmas shopping center Hi, I'm Carmen Banana. What is your name? Uh, Judy Richardson. Judy Richardson. Uh -huh. Judy, this, these are some wonderful things you do. Would you describe them to me? Uh, well, um, my line, Lillian Bloom, uh -huh. um, is a mixture of a lot of things. These are a lot of things that I do with shell, inlay shell, and uh, here's some black onyx. Uh -huh. I don't know, I, I kind of do a lot of the big earrings yeah. around uh -huh. here. Uh -huh. yeah. They look real nice. I look, did you do these that you're wearing? Yes, I did. Uh -huh. Ooh, those are really Those are snake skin. Snake, snake skin. skin. Yeah, with some hematite. Ooh, yeah. that's nice. Oh, well, nice thank work. you. Well, uh -huh. I like yours too. Well, thank you. Yeah. Just some simple uh, bananas. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Okay. Delicious. Yes. <laughs> Listen, thanks a lot. Thanks. Bye. And this is the plaque that the city council put here to designate this as the Renaissance Marketplace created in 1972. Designated, oh, I don't want to read this whole thing, but it is for handcrafted arts and crafts. So there go some wild skateboarders going through. Woo! God. <laughs> Faster than lightning. God, right over the cord, too. Oh, well, don't tell anyone at the studio. Hi, how are y'all doing? What, what is your name? Jill. And what kind of work do you do? Pictures. And would you describe them to me? Do the what? Would you describe them? Are they prints or photographs or what? They are from photographs. They are transferred on paper and with person uh -huh. cut on right paper. There. Right Show there. Show him. Yay. It's a good one. And uh, after the hand colors with watercolors. They're all watercolors and prints. Mm -hmm. Yep. I see. And uh, are, you, uh, are you from around here? Uh, not really. I'm from France. What, what part? Paris. Paris, a nice, a nice town, isn't it? Is it, yeah. Well, listen, welcome to Texas. How long have you been in Texas? Um, one year in Texas. Oh, I see. And have you been selling on the drag all that time? My wife does, yes. Oh, I see. Either you, oh, I see. And you have postcards over here, too. Oh, would you give those postcard whirl? Uh, uh, do, do they whirl? Oh, they do they whirl? Would you whirl them? Sure. Don't they have whirl in French? Whirl. Whirl. You know, whirl. What is that? Whirl? Whirl it, you know, whirl it around. Okay. Like that. <laughs> okay. I'm teaching him a new word, folks. It's whirl. W H I R L. Woo! That's false. Well, what do you think? It's all, no, you can't injure me. <laughs> you <put> fame. <laughs> yeah. Okay, folks, we're going to run. Thanks for showing us your postcards and your prints. Thank you. We'll see you. Bye. Hi, we can't forget, what is your name? Diana. We can't forget Diana over here in the corner, can you? She has the front corner today on this wild Saturday afternoon. Diana, I love your work. It looks like some of these earrings move. Yes, they're jointed. Would you, could you pick one of those up and show us how it moves? Oh, how cute. And they're little, Calicas. they're little. Calicas. Little cat, calico cats. Uh-huh. Those are just the cute, are they enameled or painted or what? They're painted. They're painted. And here's some more, you have some, uh, Little Gumby cats, <laughs> and I love those. They're real fun looking. Well, you have some real fun design. Bracelets, mm -hmm. how fun. Leather bracelets. Uh -huh. Well, how fun. Thanks. Looks like there's a lot of Christmas gifts around here, folks. Good. Come spend your money here. Say that again. Come spend your money here. Yes. <laughs> you have some earrings for me? Here, yes, right here. Ah, look at this. You wear these. These are quite nice. Those are earrings? These have nice red bananas on oh, them. Oh, they have. A banana earrings. Oh, these are wonderful. What is your name? Olivia. 
Oh, baby, these are really nice. Oh, and here's some with the moons. Oh, these are definitely Carmen banana earrings, aren't they? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> and what other designs do you have? See, all sorts of inter inter interesting uh, stones and beadwork in these. Austrian crystals, antique beads. And do these all, the, oh, I see these all move. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look Look at this. Oh, I love these little Australian crystals. Austrian. <laughs> Australian. <laughs> now, now she's the perfect one, folks. She's correcting Carmen Bananas. English. But that's all right. Someone needs to do it. <laughs> I'm not sure what to say to somebody with food on their head and a 52-inch bust and a mustache. <laughs> You mean a yellow mustache, don't a yellow you? Yellow mustache, yes. Well, I think you just said enough. Yeah. That was pretty good. <laughs> yeah. We'll see. I love your jewelry. Hey, this is Sue McCarthy. She does great. Sue. Rabbit. Hello. Would you? Oh, so you're wearing one of these? Yes. Why don't you describe it to us? Well, they're wrap-around pants. You put them on like huge diapers. They're great pants. Well, so Carmen good Banana pants. could even wear them. Definitely. And so how do they? How do? Can you sort of show me one? Sure. You know, I'm from I'm not from Arkansas, but I'm I do believe in show me. <laughs> okay, and are these tie-dyed? Is that what that is? That's right. Now so you can just put this on over another pair of pants. That's right. Well, I like that already, and I like the open legs. Okay, you know. Great. Hi, there you go. It is my best feature, is my <laughs> legs. <laughs> That's at least what they say. <laughs> oh, I see. And you just tie it in back like that. Mm. Oh, I see. You're pulling it up. You're pulling the bottom of it up and wrapping it around you. Just like you diapers. Be, you, know, you, you could sort of be talking while you're doing well, this. Well, this is it. That's oh, I Big see. diapers. That's it. Uh -huh. You got it. That's it. And you have these wonderful colors. All and different you're also colors. doing some earrings. Some beadwork. Looks fun. And tie what are these? Socks. Tie dyed socks. Yeah. Happy feet. Oh gosh, I love those. Great, huh? These are really wonderful. <laughs> Fun idea. Great. Well, listen, dear. Enjoyed stopping by and talking right, to thank you. Thank you. Enjoyed so, talking to you. Sure. We'll see you. Right. Bye. Oh hi. Hi. How are you? Real good. So, what are you having for breakfast this morning? Well, I'm having my nice little uh, vanilla ice cream cone, which well, is nutritious. It really is. Well, uh, can I tell you a secret? I sure can. It's sort of late in the afternoon for breakfast. Well, you know, I had a really nice Friday night. Oh, did you? <laughs> you know, I think a lot of people had a good Friday night last night mm -hmm. because there's a lot of people with what I would call severe hangovers. Yeah, yeah. Well, it does happen, but you look like a partying kind of girl. <laughs> I have been known to kick up my heels every now and then. Uh-huh. <laughs> what is your name? Monette. Monette? Uh huh. Are you a student? You're just no, the cutest I'm, thing no, around. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> no, I go to North Texas. I'm just here for the weekend. You went to North Texas? So did I. Did and you? then? Yes. Ah, tell you my alma mater. <laughs> of course, I just, you know, just a few, you know, years uh -huh. ago. Well, I'm a junior, so I'm still are there. You? Very interesting. You aren't? No. Why aren't you interesting? Well, I'm just like Joe's student, you know. It's, it's kind of true. Don't you mean uh, <laughs> Joette student? Joette student. It's true. And so, uh, where's your hometown? Are you from here? Yeah. You're here in Austin. Austin. Is you're a local? I'm a local. A local. Damn local. straight. God. I'm oh, Texas. No, don't, don't cuss on our oh, I'm show. Sorry. I'm sorry. We have a family show. You I'm, can't I'm curse. I'm embarrassed. Please, please forgive me. That's all right. I'll see about editing it out. That's all right. Well, you know, we we actually do have children that watch our show, so we always. That's kind of scary. Keep it clean. <laughs> okay, honey, we got to keep moving. We have this great jewelry booth. Listen, tell me your name one more time. Christina. Christina, enjoy talking to you. Don't work too hard. Don't sweat oh, too much. Oh, I know. Time. Boy, I tell you, this is hard work, isn't it? <laughs> What's your name? I'm Donna Griggs. Hi, Donna. How are you doing? What kind of work are you doing over there? I do a bunch of bead work. We have the original love beads here from the 60s. We're cool. That was way before my time. I wasn't even born then bracelets and um, they originated in San Francisco and now I'm the only one who does them and they're really neat. I braid them. They're made of nickel silver. And I see is that some copper or brass or what? Uh, copper. Just a mixture of metals also. Uh -huh.
mother told him someday he would be a man And he'd be the leader of a rock and roll band People will come from miles around Hear a big banjo when the sun go down And maybe someday his name will be in light Saying, Johnny, be good tonight be good. Woo! That was one of, what is your name? Dave Banjo Seed. Dave, hi, how you doing? Banjo Seed? Banjo Seed, yeah. <laughs> is that your real name? No. <laughs> it sure sounds good though, doesn't it? It works. <laughs> tell you, they're everywhere, aren't they? Oops, there whoa, it goes. Whoa, folks. there goes there one. Go. <laughs> A big roll. <laughs> No, you aren't supposed to laugh at people when they fall. Oh, I'm sorry. But he's so well protected, he, it doesn't hurt. He really is. He's been through it before. <laughs> Hi. Hi. And what's your name? Iris Springflower. Iris, what are you making over here? I'm making a friendship bracelet. Oh, and would you describe what they are? Well, the people who uh, wear them, it's a, so a sign of friendship and love. Lo peace you, bracelets. Oh, I see. So you like, do you give them to someone else or can you wear it? Can you get it for yourself? You can do both. Oh, I see. Yeah. If you're into peace and love, you can wear it or if you love someone, you can give it to them. Exactly. You now got it. Oh, I got it. Yeah. yeah. Wonderful. And what does your sign say? All made with love. Right. Oh, how sweet. And I sell them for only $3 each, two for five. What a deal. I know. It's how I make my living and pay my rent and eat. <laughs> oh, really? Yes. What are, do you think most of the people that are here are actually making their living? Oh, for sure. Most of them. Oh, yes. <laughs> Would you say all? Uh, I'm not sure about all, but I could uh, say most. Uh, okay. So, what are these beautiful uh, shirts that you're that, that you're showing? Tie dyes. That I make all myself. But I especially like the underwear. Aren't those oh, cute? Oh, oh, look at those. Those are beautiful. Yeah. Look at this folks. Something for everyone. Uh huh. I love it. And what else? You have uh, more underwear and some more T-shirts. Yeah, underwear and T-shirts is all I got today. Uh -huh. That's Sometimes great. I have other stuff, but. Kind of on an underwear and t-shirt roll today. Uh-huh. That happens. Oh, I love this red one right here. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, it is. That is really nice. They're fun to make. Fun to wear. And and you make all of this yourself? Oh, sure. Yeah. Do you have anyone helping you when you make all this? No. This is just, I just hang out at the house. Me and my dog make the tie-dyes. I get moral support. Keeps me off the streets. How are you doing? <laughs> fine. fine. Are y'all Are y'all from here in Austin? Well, we used to live here in Austin uh, from about 69 to 76. So we live in Fort Worth now, and we always come a couple times a year. And whenever you come to Austin, what's the first place you go to? To the drag. Really? really? Where else? Where else? Well, folks, it's getting to be the end of the day. It's time to mosey back to Casa Carmen. I hope all of you had some great ideas for gifts down here at the Renaissance Marketplace. Remember, most people here on weekdays, uh, Monday through Saturday, and you can find also find a lot of these people down at the Armadillo Christmas Bazaar, the two weeks before Christmas, at the Offrey House. So until then, be sure to get in drag. Come on and get in drag as often as possible. We'll see you. Good night from Carmen Banana. Good night. Is this working? What? Good evening. This is Chet Banana with the Banana Bureau. Did you know that Carmen's Banana Cooking, seen every Friday night at 10.30, can now be seen at midnight on Sundays? If you're setting your VCRs, this is Monday at 12 a.m. Chet Banana with another banana fact. Thanks for your support. <laughs>